Not too much. Very far spray. Just to yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Welcome back to my channel and if you're new hi I'm Sin and welcome to my channel and in today's video I'm going to be doing yet another hair review slash how-to video so in this video I'm going to be reviewing a 613 wig so I think I'm gonna let this one be how I color it to get the color that I get I'm gonna show you guys the inspo and what I'm aiming for right here this is what I'm hoping for but we're going to see what color I get and see if I can put it together. And I'm going to just take you guys, you know, along with me to the end result. But yeah, I look like this because I just got done working out and I'm about to wash my hair. I made me a little aloe vera mixture. I, it was supposed to be aloe vera gel, but I don't think that it's gel. I probably made a juice again. <laughs> but I'm going to see. But anyway, to what we're talking about. So let me go ahead and tell you guys about the hair. Cause I forgot to look it up, honestly. And sorry about my chair, it's very squeaky. Okay, it's from Tuneful Official Store. I guess that's what they're called. And I got a 13 by 6 HD transparent 613 blonde lace front, 26 inches, 180% density. Because to me, I feel like with 613 hair, I don't want it too long because it's 613 hair. So I just, you know, I didn't want it too long. And so, how much this wig cost? It was, let me if it with me. Okay, here we go. It was $192.32. Okay, yeah, so the wig cost in total $192.32. It um I had $13 worth of coupons and I got free shipping. So yeah, basically um because it was $191.08. So basically it just took all the tax off itself for like a little bit. But yeah, so that's all the specs about it. We're just gonna go ahead and look into it. But this is the bad at the premium. Cause I don't believe the other ones came in bags. And they actually have little gifts. Well, I think the last wig had lashes in it. They were ugly. These are all right. I would wear these. So these are the lashes. I would actually wear these. I think I used to have lashes near this style. And they sent a wig cap. Thank you. So the thing that alarmed me was I've never received a wig inside a pack like this. It gave very much hair store, so you know it kind of scared me. But as you can see, 26. And I've never worn 613 hair before. Ever. So this is very new to me. Well, I've worn a synthetic 613 wig that was sent to me. I'll link that video. But not like this kind of 613 wig. So, mm. yeah, I'm just honestly scared of 613 hair. So, the way I'm adding this though, it's just because like I already have like a bad thing for 613. Like I just feel like it just be looking crazy sometimes. And then I want to do it myself. Like I'm crazy. But this is a 13 by 6, but the size you only get 2 inches. So, yeah. So that's a bummer. But again, I paid $192 for this. So you kind of get what you pay for. Um, I don't know if it's thick or thin. I want to try it on. I kind of want to do a ponytail, but I don't know how I would feel if I do that. Because I feel like this hair is. I think I'm going to change this to a side part. Turn these lights.
Okay. We are gonna see what we can do because I think I'm gonna just wear it down. Put some body wave curls in it. I think that'd be very cute. Now is this giving? Okay, it might be this. Yeah, that's giving good inches. So, so far I give it a, I give it a, a five out of five. I haven't had no shedding. I feel like I've gotten what I paid for. Now I haven't actually looked at the lace. But I feel like it's probably transparent lace. But we're going to do it. So, yeah, that's that. Also, I am going to try to tone the knots. Like how I've seen on TikTok stuff. Oh, it's pre-plugged. Yeah, that's good. So, yeah, five out of five. But, um, I forgot what I was saying. Oh, yeah, I'm going to tone the knots. I go to the hair store today to get all that stuff. So, I'm going to end this part here. And we'll go to the next part. <laughs> Okay, y'all, so I'm filling up this kettle. I'm going to fill it up four times with water. Kind of full and poured into the sink. That's just to kind of try to give you guys an amount of water that I use to dip the hair in. So these are the colors that I got from the hair store. I got two bottles of Cajun Spice. I got one bottle of Paprika, but I did not use it. And then I got a bottle of this Via Naturals hair color, Sunset Red. Just in case, you know, I wanted to add a little something to it so this is the wig after i have washed it i toned the knots um i was gonna show you guys that but i ended up not recording it but um i left it up there too long so some of the mixture got onto the strands of hair which kind of actually gave it like dimension so now i'm opening the bottles to get prepped up put them in order so i don't get confused with the colors that i'm putting in there and um just just getting prepared I'm going to take this guys to be um, glue gel and a brush and that's what I'm going to cover the knots and the lace with so that you know I don't tone the um, lace with color. So here I'm putting in the two bottles of Cajun Spice and y'all that water was so hot. <laughs> so instead I used the water from the sink to get the color out. I thought something was in my eye so I was looking in the camera. But yeah I used the two bottles of Cajun Spice and then I got a paper towel and checked the color. I highly recommend that and you, as you can see I seen that it was a little too like yellow orange so I added the bottle of red to um give it more of like an orangish reddish tone and I seen okay I like this color this is what I want so I moved forward and put the wig in there so I just did it to see how the color was going and the color turned out like perfect but I thought that it was gonna dry like that I forgot that you know hair when it's wet it looks darker than when it's dry so i thought that you know i got the color that i wanted but it turned out to be lighter but i still liked it and so i'm rinsing the gel off with hot water just to get it off of there and then i'm gonna flip it around and rinse the hair with cold water just to lock the color in but i didn't really have any um color bleed which was really good and i know you guys looking at the sink mom but i did clean the sink and get the color out so you know don't worry about it <laughs> But yeah, this is the final result, and then I'm going to show you guys what it looked like. Alright y'all, so I'm about to do my hair. Excuse my ball cap. It's not giving ball cap size up. I was trying a new product, which definitely I will not use for my ball cap anymore. I'll probably just use it for if I want to slap a wig on for two seconds and take it off. But anyway, I'm going to show you guys the color that it turned out. So, this is the color. It's very much giving Goldilocks. I don't know how I feel about it yet. But I'm going to try it. I'm going to do it for you guys. So, we're going to see how it goes. I'm not going to do the whole put it on, on camera because... If you want to see how I install my wigs, you can watch my other video. I'll link it. You can watch that one. Also, this is my first time ever installing a 613 wig on myself. Well, in general. And all the other stuff. So, I'm learning. I don't want to show you guys. And I mess up horribly on the process. 
So I'm gonna do this myself and then come back and let you guys see the final result. And we're just gonna go from there. So I'll be back once I put install the wig. All right, you guys, so this is the final look. And I can't believe I did this. <laughs> so yes, number one, this wig, this 613 wig, it very much surpassed my expectations. When it comes to 613 wigs, I always associate them with shedding and tangling and they're only gonna last two days, three days max. But this wig definitely feels, you know, like I could get a good wear out of it. Even like after I watercolored it, because I watercolored it with like boiling water, I expected it to just be no good, but you can see it now, like it looks great. I look great. I thought I was gonna look like a clown, but look at me. Beautiful. You know, of course I had to put a little bit of makeup on, some lashes, because my lash extensions, they need to be, you know, redone, but we're on a budget, so I'm gonna wait until like towards my birthday to do that. But yes, so so I am gonna put a little bit of shine spray on it just to you know, yeah. Not too much, very far spray. Just to yeah, 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 yeah. And also, the way that I like to do my hair like this, like with the curls and stuff, is I flip, 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 flip to kind of give it some volume in it. You know, put this back just so that I can get that. And then I'm going to brush the back. And then y'all. Yeah. So you guys comment down below and let me know what you think. You know, it's my birthday one. It's very much September. So I wanted to, you know, try something different. I've never worn 613 here before. I've never, you know, colored 613 here before myself. I've never done this color before, period. Like, I'm happy. I think now that I've tested out, you know, this vendor with 613 here, I would definitely, definitely, um, get it a little bit longer i kind of like it this length though but y'all know i'm kind of into the longer hair the 30s and longer but i just i gotta give it to it this has very much surpassed my expectations and i definitely should give myself more credit and i should give myself you know i don't know what to say but i should just give it give it more like and excuse my background y'all that's clothes i'm trying to sell of logans and stuff like that whatever anyway yeah so and the lace, I expect the 613 lace to just not blend, not look good. Like, but it, it this just looks good, okay? <laughs> Click the link down below and get this wig. No, it's not sponsored. I paid for the wig myself. This is not, you know, the wig they sent me so that it could be this good. Da, 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 no, but I do recommend it. So, yeah, if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Make sure you check out my hair review playlist and check out my other videos. And hopefully I'll see you guys in the next one. This is Sin signing off. Peace.